My name is Manja and I'm doing my PhD at the Dementia Research Center at the Institute of Neurology. I studied neuroscience. I was initially interested in the brain in general and how it works. Um, and then I started working at the Dementia Research Center and I started seeing a lot of patients, which um, has really opened my eyes what it, what it means to have Alzheimer's disease and what these people go through and what they have to, have to cope with. And it's now really become my main focus of my research and this really strengthened my commitment to, to, to work in that area. So I was working at the Dementia Research Center and we had this idea for um, um, a, a project. Um, so we, we handed a, a proposal to the Alzheimer's Society and we were really lucky in, in getting, the, getting funding for the project. So I'm working on a project which looks at why Alzheimer's disease doesn't affect everybody in the same way. Um, so most people would associate Alzheimer's disease with memory problems and confusion. A number of patients who have Alzheimer's disease, but the disease affects a different part of the brain because they, can, they can't interact with the visual world. And at the same time, they have a lot of insight, so they're very aware of what is happening to them. And I'm trying to find out um, what is really happening in the brain. So I'm looking at their brain scans and really try to find out what's, what's happening. Well, the Asimov Society has made it all possible in the end. Um, so without the Asimov Society, I wouldn't be able to do that PhD, which is um, and the PhD itself, obviously, very essential part of um, every young scientist's career. Um, but also to be able to, to, to see these patients, to carry out my research, to organise these support groups, to, to help these, these, these people. That's always, I think, a highlight, really, to, to have the feeling that you that you make a small difference to people and to, to give something back as well.